What's good guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're out here at the new FTL shop. Uh, there's no signage on it right now, we're still freshly moving in. Before we go in, I just wanna mention that we're right here next to the Vicious Cycle Bike Shop in West Ice of New York, which is my hometown. And funny enough, my first FTL office, the FTL HQ, the OG one, there's a video on this channel from back in the day. 2018 to 2019, I was in there. That window right up there was my office and I do dearly miss it. If you saw in the last video, October of 2023, when we got kicked out of the FTL shop in Bayshore, the owner sold the building. They wanted to give me four days notice to get out. I was really stressed out looking for a new spot in Long Island. And thankfully Mike at the Vicious Cycle was willing to split his shop in half and give me the other half because this building was originally two shops and he took over the whole thing. So I have my own private entrance here. We just had to do some work. We had to put the wall up and I'll show you that right now. Let's head inside. And I'm really, really happy with how this space is coming along so far. This wall was never here. It goes all the way to the back past those doors. And my buddy Mike, he actually built the wall, Honey Homes Restoration. He did the whole shop. I kind of gave him an idea of what I wanted to do as far as design. Did his thing. I was away on a trip for most of it. He was just in here working away by himself. He did all this, hung the bikes on the wall. And these two bikes are retired right now. This is my new one. Put the old racks from the old shop in, but we don't need the wall mounts anymore. I really like the way this OSB board looks. I think it works well, especially with the sign that we saved from the other building. Got all the products on here. I was probably wondering maybe why there hasn't been a new FTL collection in a little bit. The whole reason why is the whole moving thing. I've been working on a new site, moving shop. I uh, just got married last week, actually. That's one thing I've been working on. I'm a married man. Your boy is a married man. Now that we're settled in here, we're gonna be working on some new products. But yeah, we still have tons of stuff on the site. Been dropping new colorways of frame bags, bike lights. Back to the shop. So we saved these showcase displays. Um, we got the TV mounted up there. This is where I kind of have neglected this front entrance so far. I want to do like a little coffee area stand right here. I think it would be cool, but maybe get like an espresso machine, something fancy up here. Maybe have my mom paint another mural on this wall. This is all free parts. Good time to mention it right now. There will be a grand opening for this store. I don't know how often I'll be open. Quick interruption. We're going to do the shop opening on Saturday, May 11th. So stay tuned to the FTL channels for flyers or my Instagram stories. And I hope to see you there. Let's get it. Free parts to give away. Probably one of Alex's beat wheels. Some of this stuff's pretty good. We'll have a ton of stuff for sale, ton of stuff on sale, and a ton of free stuff if first come, first serve. All the outerwear right here. A lot of this may be sold out, but I know the jacket I'm wearing right now. I got the double tan on. I kind of like this, it's pretty fresh. One thing I love about this new shop is you see the sun coming in right now. We have those big giant windows and it's not even like golden hour yet. Once that sun comes down, maybe another 20 minutes, it's gonna be insane in here. Tire rack over here, all the Merit tires you need. Obviously we got the Merit FTL tires down here. One of my favorite parts of this whole building, my buddy Mike who built this place told him I wanted an arch with sliding doors. He restored this like 100 year old window. It opens and closes, which is pretty cool, but I like it open. Sign Ashley got me, the neon sign. The blue looks so good on the black. That's very FTL right there, blue and black. These are the sliding wood doors to the back room, my office. And these are sick. Uh, almost. They open all the way, which is really cool because you'll see in a few minutes. Um, I did a poll on my Instagram story. I said, call out some tricks. We're gonna have a session in the shop on the flat rail. If you don't follow me on Instagram, follow me at BillyPerry631 at FTLBMX. So yeah, come into the back room right here. We have the workstation. I mean, we got some orders on the table. Get to those in a little bit. If you guys wanna order, ftlbmx.com slash store. Everything helps with the build and everything going on right now. You guys are the best. So you guys are keeping this place doors open. Like I said, this is mostly an online store. I only open here and there. Shelving everywhere, racks from the other store. Compared to the other shop, the storage area in my office is like triple the size. The ceilings are tall, which is good for riding. Shelving across the top. The one thing I do want to change right now is I have a lot of cardboard. I want everything in clear bins. I don't know what I'm doing with this. This doesn't fit. I don't know if I want to keep this. The couch, I don't know if I want it here or in the front or a different couch. And then this is my computer area with shelving. Pretty much it. I've got the fridge, printer, some pictures on the wall. One thing I don't have up yet are these bad boys. My prized possessions, my babies, the OG. This one's dusty. <laughs> Damn. This is the OG Billy Perry BMX. I think I got this in 2016, 100,000 subscribers. And then you could see the difference of style on the YouTube play buttons right here. This is 100,000 for the FTL account when they changed the style of plaques, which I think is pretty cool. I have one of each. Then I just have one of these bad boys, one million for the Billy Perry channel. 
pretty cool. Um, so I got to get those hung up somewhere. Would not have those without you guys. So thank you guys, whoever stuck around from 2016. I appreciate you guys. And whoever's new here, welcome to the channel. I have a few parts over here, old frames I saved. This is my gold wheels from my new bike I just built. But as you'll see in a second, I don't have the gold on anymore. I changed it to black. If you guys think the gold should go back on, let me know if you like the black. I personally like the black, but you'll see in a second. I think it's time. Look at how open this place is. This is sick. This is really cool. So once that sun comes in, it will be shining. Yeah, I'm really happy with this space, even though, yeah, we moved in November. I've been in here for three, four months, and the rent just raised 35%. So rest in peace. If you guys like FTL, if you like what we're doing, you guys like the videos, all the support helps online. Like I said, new site in the works, we're gonna be Shopify. So hopefully that will be rolled out in the next month or so, take all forms of payment. We always ship worldwide, so name a country. Besides like North Korea, we probably ship there. Notice it before, because it blends very nicely. But here is our trusty flat rail. And now we actually finally have a purpose for it. Knock on wood. I have not bonked that with my head yet, so that's good. Let's get to this flat rail session. of everyone that commented on my Instagram story. Probably 90% of the requests were <laughs> insane. A lot of people asked me to do flat flares. Pick the reasonable ones that I could do and there's a lot of overlap on people who ask for certain tricks and then there's certain cool ones that are one off. So I'm gonna announce one name for every trick. So let's start it off easy. We have an ice pick grind and that is from Simply Aiden. First try, right. A tooth hanger for Joe Swab. Shout out to the homie Joe Swab. Not the whole rail, but we'll take it. That was decent. We're just warming up. You guys just saw the first grind, by the way. So as we progress on, these are going to get harder and harder and probably not first try. Into the double peg tricks now. We're going to do a pegs bar spin for bombers detailing. Wow. So we're three for three on the first try. Pegs easy 180 for the homie Jin in Japan. Whoa. You are in a dangerous spot, sir. Four for four so far with first tries. I know that wasn't the prettiest, but I don't care. <laughs> Eggs hard 180 for Ik Mag Tic Tacs. Wow, five for five. <laughs> All right, next one's gonna be a little bit hard. We have a Pegs hard 180 slider from Bradley Ramirez. Oh, uh, almost. Hundred percent. Let's go. Last of the pegs tricks, we're gonna do pegs crank flip for Chris Cun nine two one. Shout out to Chris Cun. It's been a while since I've done one of those. My last wheel didn't uh, spin too well, but finally we're back. You want the predator right now, Alex? Austin wants it, not me. All right. Shout out to Austin Mazer, one of my best friends, FTL member. Now residing in Spain, wants me to do a predator on this short rail. Could have bought out of that. Wow. But that wasn't in the request, so we just got predator. I'm just gonna get this one out of the way because I absolutely suck at it and it's not gonna look good if I do it now or if I do it later. Some of you mean folk wanted me to do this one a crooked grind and <laughs> That's it. Yeah, clean. <laughs> <laughs> I'm taking it. Feeble grind for Yolfine BMX. Feeble bar for the homie in the UK. Revive BMX. This dude has my whole complete uh, volume merit FTL setup. The black, white, and blue ones. Shout out to him. Feeble bar. That was pretty easy. So <laughs> things are going smooth so far. I don't want to jinx myself, but now we're doing the feeble easy 180. And the other night when I was in here by myself, I did it first try, so let's see how long it takes. <laughs> Taking it. Feeble Hard 180 for TJ BMX. That was good. I'm taking it, dude. 
That's a lame boy. <laughs> the second most requested trick right here, maybe third most requested, is the ice pick bar spin. A few of my homies request FRS Law, Jaden Sheffo, Cameron Finley. That was good. Yeah, that was third try. Ice pick to switch by by Nonaraka.mp4. Wow. Taking that one. All right, so ice pick suicide for the homie Bear 4130 in the UK. I want to say the last time I actually did an ice to suicide was in the UK, which is funny. That's the video playing on the screen right now. If you want to come see it, look at it. Right here, ice suey. Let's see if I can do it on a much smaller rail in the shop. Right back here. to back. Oh, mm -hmm. ice soup. It's time. Jackie, it's coming off. Oh, well, guys, wearing the exact same shirt. Yeah. Nothing's changed. I'm taking it. Wow. Not pretty, but hands were off. The ice pick to easy 180 out from BMX Danger. Wow. Over pegs hard for Bofi, the homie Bryce. Smith for PJ Diaz and Andika Rubani. Oh, 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 wow. Second try. Yes, sir. <laughs> All right, Austin Mazer, hang our crank arm. That was a real crank arm. <laughs> <laughs> that was sick. I'll take it. <laughs> crank arm, the whole rail for rocker guy. I might need a second one. Wow. I might not do that just for that reason. I don't think you guys understand. This is sharp and rusty. <laughs> All right. You <laughs> would have been fine. Switch pegs to switch bar for Noel 350Z. How did I not realize I wasn't riding my trusty old bar pad here? I don't have the frame bag on either. I didn't even realize. Here we go. Time! Time for the fun stuff. We'll get the basic one out of the way. We're on the computer now. We ran out of battery on our phone. A rail ride for a KNZ FXD and a few other. So that's the basic one. Oh no. I have a long battle ahead, so I'm taking that one. You'll see why. That's not the end of the tire ride. So for my homie BMX Josh in the UK, Doing tires to bar and about, I don't know, 15 other people wanted this. <laughs> Back to first try. <laughs> and that's why I didn't want to waste too much time on the regular tires. For James O'Mara, Mike Brennan, Jack Hennick, and this was the second most requested trigger, I think it was Rail Ride Switch Bar. <laughs> wow, back to back. <laughs> Tricks of the night. <laughs> Tire suicide for Julian, the official season, and a few other people. Let's see. I don't know. Three for three? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> three for three! Ah! Guys on a roll. We have a long session tomorrow. We're going to film Daily Cruise 49 in the city, so stay tuned for that next video. Giving one more attempt on a Pegs Hard 3. Marcus Powell just wanted a Pegs Hard 3 attempt, so I don't know what's going to happen. Maybe I do it, maybe I don't. One of my worst tricks. That counts. <laughs> that was... I'm going to do another solid. And on that, we end the video. Thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed the shop. Let me know what we should do as far as renovations, if you enjoyed. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe. Hit up the shop, ftlbmx.com. Love you guys. Thank you for tuning in. See you in the next one. Peace out.